Um, in terms of projects that we've been working on, uh, we're quite a new studio. Uh, we've just began to sort of work on some slightly larger scale uh, projects. Uh, we've recently completed um, a project in Dubai, in the Dubai Mall, which is next to the Burj Khalifa, which involved uh, various different surfaces for a, a very large retail project. And it enabled us to sort of uh, have a bit of budget to play with and to show some new, some new work, as well as to address various different elements of the project, which was really, really exciting. We're currently working on a project, um, a temporary project, an installation in Clerkenwell for Clerkenwell Design Week. It's entitled The Heart of Architecture and uh, we're creating a, an installation that's going to represent Clerkenwell um, as an architectural hub within the world. Our, uh, Clerkenwell has the largest concentration of architects in the world so we're sort of celebrating that on a small scale installation which is uh, going to involve a new surface which is quite experimental and really exciting. Even the, the reason that I'm here is sort of a proof of, of the fact that, in my opinion, architecture is becoming less and less specific in its role. I think uh, all creative mediums are blurring and uh, my studio is involved in sort of crossover between architecture, interior design and even sort of textile design. I think uh, you can apply the same <coughs> philosophy or, or aspiration to most of those sorts of practices and I think really it's just about improving the quality of life for inhabitants or users or viewers of our, of our work. If I was visiting London for a short time, um, there are lots of places to see obviously. I, can, um, I would say one of my um, favourite architectural features is in the British Museum, which is the Great Court and it's got a beautiful um, kind of a geometric glass ceiling which is, which is lovely and casts beautiful shadows on the space below. Uh, I'm also interested in uh, smaller scale architecture and installation pieces and there's a, a fantastic uh, Thomas Heatherwick installation uh, in, the Welcome, in the Welcome Trust building which I think you can go and see at uncertain times um, and it's definitely worth a look. My studio is, is interested predominantly in the use of light and shadow. Uh, we create surfaces that um, uh, demonstrate imagery just through the medium of light and reflection and um, for me I'm particularly interested in this sort of um, very basic laws of physics and how they can still be used creatively to, to, to produce installations and projects that are almost more interesting than some of the most technological um, options that we have available to us. Um, I think light is an incredible uh, subject to address and we do so in a very rudimentary way so we will continue to kind of play with light and shadow and um, I'm sure it will continue to inspire us.